Here's my Lift RC frame, and I used it recently when reviewing one of the first Smart Audio um, AKK VTXs, and it worked quite well. But it did have some noise on the video, and I thought at first um, I wasn't I wasn't getting the video from a clean place. But having checked into it, I was actually coming out of the power distribution board, and that should have been clean and sort of uninterrupted. The noise isn't bad. I mean, take a look at some of the stuff there. Quite flyable and stuff, but obviously, you know, you want your stuff to be as clean as you can. So I thought I'd try one of um, uh, several methods of trying to get clean video, which is to use a, a low ESR capacitor. So I have bought these um, quite largest things, pretty cheap from, um, I think they came from Amazon or eBay. I wanted to make sure they were original bits. And these are a 1000 microfarad, 35 volts. And I think I'm gonna solder in basically where the XT60 connects on here. And this should, in theory, um, stop the, the ripple in power that can cause the noise. So we know what it looks like beforehand. Let me get one of these, hopefully a squish in there, just at the back. And uh, we'll give it enough fly and see what happens. Join me in a sec. Here's the install on my quad. Not how I quite want it, but there's so little space there that it's basically laying down on the frame with the uh, bits attached obviously following the polarity and here's the before after example of what we got there now I should point out that I wasn't exactly sure where this noise was coming from the flight control I'm using actually had two issues I I'll put a link to uh, my review of it but I had a failed inductor so I didn't have any regulated power through it and then I had one of the pins fail so it, it was in the wall, so I'm not sure if the noise is really coming from the... It's an ESC or a power problem, or it's it's literally the, the fact that going through this flight controller makes everything bad, because the flight controller is somewhat wonky. But anyway, the results are there for you to see. I've watched it several times, and at first I thought, ah, I've still got noise, it's no good. But on repeated viewings, I've kind of decided that the noise is improved... It is still there, but it's it's doing something. It hasn't quite got the amount of lines that it previously had. But I thought I'd put it here and um, leave it for you guys to cast an opinion about it. If you've got some noise, it's not a bad thing to try because it's pretty easy just to pop an extra capacitor on your um, ESC terminals there where your, your battery lead joins and see if it, it helps out there. So I'm kind of like, yeah, it's pretty good. Um, I wanted to try this one rather than use um, an LC filter because when you when you start getting to the LC filter style of things, you've already kind of let the bad power in, if you like, and then you're sort of addressing it later on. What I'm trying to do with this, the idea is to regulate the power as it comes in rather than have to deal with it later on when it goes into the video. And it's, you know, it's worked a bit. Um, it's not perfect, but um, I've got some other things to try as well on, on different quads with different uh, noise problems. So I'll be back seeing what else works and doesn't work. But if you've got an opinion, if you think it's all in my head and there's no improvement, or you think it's a bit, or you've seen similar before and tried different ideas, then I'm always uh, very interested to know so I can try some stuff out. Leave a comment below if you like, and I will catch you in the next video. Bye for now.